we say anything positive about black people. Never. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This nigga don't care about our community. You know what I'm saying? Y'all sit up there and listen to this baby baby and eat that shit up. Listen to this nigga's records. Listen to how he talk about killing pregnant women. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Listen to how he talk about robbing your sister, robbing your brother. He don't give a fuck about us. This nigga's a straight imposter. These niggas is cartoons. They don't care about our community. Never have, never will. When I come out of jail and this thug life shit get re <laughs> reincarnated, you know what I'm saying? Them niggas have a problem. Oh, Tupac out in here, run for cover, yeah. Y'all niggas was running for cover when I was in jail and shit. You know what I'm saying? When I was keeping this shit real raw. Motherfuckers don't give a fuck about our shit. They don't give a fuck about our community. They never have, never will. So now I'm back. I'm going to keep this shit real. I'm going to show y'all how to really keep it back to the essence. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? To this real shit. Yeah, I got a new album coming out. Um, it's called All Eyes On Me. It's Straight Truth. It's the first double CD rap album ever to come out. First double CD album ever to come out. In fact, you know what I'm saying? Shit. <laughs> yeah, I got Biggie Wife on it. She's singing on why, Wonder Why You... Wonder Why They... Wonder Why They Call You Bitch. <laughs> wonder Why I Called It That Album. <laughs> wonder Why I Called It Wonder Why They Call You Bitch. And Biggie's Wife is on that shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You knew why I called it that shit. Ain't no question. Oh, who else I got on the album? I got Snoop. I got Dre. Dre on California Love. He doing the beats on that. I got a song with Snoop called um, America's Most Wanted. I got E-40. Um, all, you know what I'm saying? I got everybody from the Bay. Every from Everybody from the Bay that ever put me on, I put them on this album. You know what I'm saying? Shit, I got Richie Rich, E-40, Be Legit, D-Shot, all the homies from the Click, everybody. My favorite song of the album, Ambitions is a Ride, straight up. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, it's like the first song that I recorded when I got out of jail. Shug picked me up, they came and picked me, it was nothing but love, you know what I mean? Shug came and picked me up in the limo. We rolled through Harlem, you know what I'm saying? Came out, came out straight out of the um, out of the Clinton Correctional Facility. You know what I'm saying? Yo, it was like when I walked out of jail, it was silence all throughout the whole. You know what I'm saying? The whole tier, it was just straight silence. You could hear a pin drop. Walked out of jail, got in the limo. <laughs> Looked over at the little correctional officer and was like, all right, I'll see y'all later. Picture me rolling. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's my second favorite track. But my first favorite track, <laughs> my first favorite track on All Eyes On Me, double album, coming soon, is Ambitions Is A Rider. Straight up. I can't deny it. I'm a straight rider. You don't want to fuck with me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's my first favorite track. Second favorite track, picture me rolling. Picture me rolling in my 500 bins. Ain't got no love for these niggas. There's no need to be friends. They got me under surveillance. I wish somebody could tell it. No, it's dope being sold. But I ain't the one selling. Don't want to be another number. I got a fucking gang of weed to keep from going under. <laughs> you feel me? That's all lies on me, though. Shit. When I was locked up, Niggas was giving me love, straight love. I mean, you know, when that five interview came out, it was like, niggas was like, oh, yeah, Pac locked up and all this. You know what I'm saying? They reading the article. And I was like, Thug Life is dead. And I was like, Thug Life is dead because I was like, nah, ain't none of these niggas that's free having this shit. I was like, I took Thug Life and put it in my back pocket. It was like, nah, this is mine. Choked out all the rappers that was trying to be done with my shit. <laughs> took them all out. You know what I'm saying? Mob D. Everybody that I was rapping with that was thug life, that was supposedly down, they're dead. No, they don't they don't represent thug life now. That's why we got Outlaw Immortals, you know what I'm saying? I got Yaki Gaddafi, Napoleon, Castro, Idi Amin, all the little soldiers that's actually family. That that's thug life. Big Shug, 
You know what I'm saying? Shook obviously thug life. What I meant to say is psych, Mo Prime, my brother, Mo Prime, that's who I got on, on, on Thug Life now. Thug Life is now Outlaw Immortals, but it's still the hate you gave little infants. Fucks everybody. You know what I'm saying? That's Thug Life. But, um, yeah, you know, I just want to do more for the community. I just want to help out the community because, like I said, these other niggas, they don't care about black people. You know what I'm saying? They don't think it's, baby, baby, make some more money. But they don't care. They're just here to pimp our communities. How long are we going to let this pimping go on? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't care no more. I don't have no love for nobody who doesn't believe in me. You know what I'm saying? Dolores Tucker, Calvin Butts, they can all kiss my motherfucking ass. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I've done more. I've done more just being raw, telling the truth to my people than they